Hi, I'm Nicoletta. I'm the supply chain manager for McDonald's Restaurants of Canada, and I'm here today at Cargill in London, Ontario, to answer a question we received from Armad from Edmonton, Alberta. He asks, what are legitimately in McNuggets? Is there pink goop? Armad, I'm guessing this is the image that you're referring to. It's an image that often gets associated with McDonald's, and it's a question that we get a lot. We don't know what it is or where it came from, but it has nothing to do with our chicken McNuggets. But I want you to see for yourself. So that's why we're here today at Cargill, Canada, to see how our chicken McNuggets are made. With me, I've got Jen, who's a product development scientist for Cargill Canada, and she's gonna walk us through the process. That's right, let's start in the deboning department. And as you can see, the process starts with whole chicken. We separate all of the chicken cuts and set aside the chicken breast meat for chicken McNuggets. So on this part of the line, the chicken breast that's been separated is being collected into this bin. And this is the chicken breast that we use in the chicken McNuggets. So next to the bin of chicken breast meats are pushed to the blending room and we're lifting it up and dumping it into the grinder and adding the ground chicken breast meat to the blender with some seasonings and some chicken skin and then we'll take the mixed chicken meat out of the blender. So we can see here, here's what it is. We refer back to the image for Armand. Here's the pink goo image and here's what we actually we have. So it's very different. All we've got here is just chicken breast that's been ground up um, as well as seasoning and a natural proportion of skins for flavor and as a binder. But they're not chicken nuggets just yet, so we're gonna go see how the rest of the process is made right now. In the forming room, the blended chicken meat will be portioned into the four chicken McNuggets shapes, the ball, the bell, the boot, and the bow tie. And then the chicken McNuggets shapes covered with a light batter and covered by a second thicker batter called tempura. So we just par fried the nuggets. We're going to take one off the bell. When I break it in half, you can see it's raw inside and it's the same blended meat that we took out of the blender and sent through the portioner. So we've just par fried it so we can set that batter on it, but the, the nuggets will be fully cooked in the restaurants. 